Hi guys, and welcome back to my channel. I always say it's so weird. In this video, I am trying to get a piece of spring by using pink. As you will notice throughout this video, I am having like... Um, I don't know how to put it. I'm having like uh, skin problems where my skin is being super dry at the moment and also I'm uh, breaking out pretty bad. I have like all things all over. And at this moment, I don't know really what to do about it. Um, but I'm gonna see if I can find something that I can order and use and maybe it will get better. I hope. <laughs> well, if you're wondering if I like look super crusty or something, that is just loads of dry skin acting up. So yeah, that's nice. Anyways. Uh, I hope that you will enjoy this tutorial and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and let go. So today is back to normal. <laughs> so I am of course starting off by doing my brows and as usual I am using the Paradise Pomade Ecstatic by L'Oreal Paris. There we go. And now I'm going to prime my eyelids, so I'm using the Put A Lid On It Eyelid Primer from... I think it's Benefit? No, The Balm. <laughs> it's from The Balm. I feel like this eyelid primer is kind of oily, so I think it will work now that my lids are pretty dry. I hope, at least. So I took like a bit too much, but yeah. <laughs> uh, next I am going in with the Modern Renaissance palette from Anastasia Beverly Hills. And first of all, I will be going in with the color Tempira, which is this light one. And I will be putting this all over my lid. That looks so bad because my lids are so freaking dry. It looks terrible. <laughs> but I'll keep going and see where it takes us. I think I'm going to start off by taking the color Warm Taupe, which is this one, and I will be working this into my crease. And I'm just gonna go down with this as well. And next I'm taking the color Cypress Umber or Cypress Umber, I don't know. And I will be working this on the outer corner, I think. Now I'm taking the NYX Ultimate Shadow Palette in bright and I will be using this color to put on my lid I'm 
god, I am mixing so many palettes right now. <laughs> but next I will be going in with The Magic by Juvia's Place. And I will be going in with the color Osun or Osun. Osun? I don't know, it's this very light shade. And I will be putting this on my inner corner. Next, I will be going in with the see, Eye Studio Lasting Drama Gel Eyeliner 24 Hours, and this is from Maybelline. That's what it'll have to look like. Except this. I'm gonna clean this up because it looks terrible. And for mascara today, I am using the Very Me Extend the Lash Mascara by Oriflame. This one. So I went ahead and put on some lashes also and these are the Fluff It Like It's Hot Lashes from Violet Boss. Obviously I'm showing you no lashes because they are on my face. Like there's no lashes in here obviously because they're right there. Let's go ahead and put some makeup on this face. Um, my face has been super dry lately and I have been breaking out super badly and I have no idea why. So, yeah. So I have like a billion uh, dry patches that the makeup will look terrible in and so on. But anywho, let's do it. So I am Again, using the coverage foundation from The Ordinary. I really like it and this is the lightest shade, I think. Or was there a lighter one? Um, it is like a tinsy bit too dark when it is done oxidizing. Uh, I don't care. Like, especially my nose is so freaking dry. Even though I'm bumping really gently with this uh, the sponge from Linda Hallberg Cosmetics, it is pulling up so much like skin and shit. And it's so annoying. And I am going in with the NYX HD Studio Photogenic Concealer And for powder, I am using the Luminae Sheer Finish Loose Powder as usual And now I'm taking the clear, uh, clear water resistant eyebrow gel from the brow gal. And I'm obviously running this through my brows. Now I'm going back in with the Modern Renaissance palette and the color Cypress Umber. And I will be putting this uh, underneath my lower lash line. Oh, fuck. 
like so. And next I'm going back in with the Magic Palette by Juvia's Place. And I'm going back in with the color Osun or Osun or Usun. I don't know what it's called. But I'm going back in with this color and putting it in my inner corner. But on the lower side, I guess. And I'm going back in with my mascara, put on the lower lashes. And now I'm going in with the Linda, Har Linda Halberg Cosmetics uh, Infinity Palette. And I will be using this for my face. So as usual, <laughs> I'm taking the colors Mafe and uh, Cigar or uh, bronzing, I guess. I have absolutely no faith in my nose today, but I will still be trying. I sort of don't want to touch it because it will just get worse. So we can be super gentle and hoping it won't pull anything up. It already looks like a freaking plague. Yeah, it'll just have to look like that because I don't want to keep messing around. For blush, I will be going in with the color Pinwheel, which is this color. For highlighter, hello! <laughs> For highlighter, I I think I'll be mixing the colors Virgio and Milky Way, these two. <clears throat> and for lips, I am taking the Liquid Suede Cream Lipstick. And this is in the color... Downtown Beauty, so it's just like a nice brown, I think. But yeah, this is it. So I'm just gonna I think take my hair down and I will be right back. So yeah, you guys, this is the finished look. Uh, I really just wanted to make spring come because I'm so over winter by now and we still have so much snow here. <laughs> and let's see, last time it snowed yesterday. So we're still getting winter, but yeah. So I just wanted to make spring pop through a bit and that's where these eyes are coming from and also me wearing a pink shirt. Pretty sure this is the only pink clothing I own. So yeah. And it says Which basically means asshole or bag of shit, <laughs> I guess. <laughs> the, the Swedish word for it would be hug, I think. So, yeah. Anyways, I'm rambling. <laughs> so, this, you guys, is the finished look. And I'm super digging this brown lipstick. 
Even though I kind of look like I've been eating poop. Still a pretty neat color. I really like it. <laughs> Anyways, I hope that you enjoyed this tutorial. And if you did, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Give the video a thumbs up. And to leave a comment saying what you want to see next time. Or what you thought about this video. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye!